Welcome back to another episode of The Eminence in Shadow. Last episode, we had the amazing forbidden secret technique of the background character arts. Fantastic. Fantastic. The funniest part was probably when he landed on his head. Then he would turn around, put his head still on the ground and said, Marana! Another one! And Oriana, I think, actually started to respect him till the end, right? In, from the beginning, she was like, you know what? This person... I can see the fire in his eyes, even though he's getting mobbed so fucking hard. And at the end, she said, I may have won the battle, but something about like, I, but she, I, what did he say? Something about the spirit. She definitely respects him at the end. Plus one waifu. Um, had a little bit of Sherry Barnett. She's just seems to be pretty normal. Honestly, she's just a normie girl. She's, I like her a lot. She's kind of the way she eats the chocolates. Like, holy shit, she's just moaning super hard. But so I guess she's just here for the plot in terms of finding out what the artifact is doing. And then we have the fake shadow or shadow garden attacking us. Now, barrier has been erected. Ha ha ha. Yes. And then you saw Sid using his like grip strength thing, right? With the uh, with the slime. It didn't work as soon as the barrier went up. So then when he got slashed when trying to save Oriana, I thought, is this guy actually dead? No, it can't be. Obviously, he's not dead. But I'm trying to think, how is he going to heal himself? If he's been slashed and the slime magic doesn't really work. Now, there are many different ways this could have been done, right? It's probably he's trying to, like, someone also said, it's the most background character thing to do to be the first one to die out of an enemy invasion. He's like, yeah, I agree. This is probably, probably still definitely part of his plan. Also, it gets him out of the situation so he can come back as Shadow, right? Without any suspicion. And the way he, he probably just dodged it. And we're just probably going to see, like, frame by frame moment of, oh, another secret background tech, like, tech where... The guy was attacking, I was like, oh, I'll just cut myself up and put a bunch of ketchup there, and it's like, I'll just act like I did. I'm dead. Um, Alexia is a also, a, I don't know why, but she's outside a barrier, so is she not allowed to participate in this arc? I don't really know. Let's, let's, let's see what happens in today's episode. Yeah, the slime goes to mush. But it won't work, right? Yeah. Maybe it's still enough to heal him. So he's like, here it comes. This is my time. I need to go <laughs> and be the first one to get taken out because that's what a background character A would do. Huh? This is a fantasy? Really? Is your school getting invaded by terrorists? He's the light. Everyone's like, oh no! But he's like, fucking finally, yes! Now, the thing he does is save Oriana but get mobbed, right? So let's see if he really did get slashed. We've come too far for this. I can't let it. It's gotta be me, not you! Yes. The most background thing to do is to get the first person to die like that. But, so did he really get slashed? It's an actual wound? Or is it a background character secret arts? No, it can't be. You died for me. She already respects him so much, but how is he gonna explain this at the end? Because he can't. Like, he can't just die. It's for you, Oriana. I just loved you. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> the cop. So good. Mmm. Press X to doubt. Oh, he's actually crying for him. Wait. What about the... The guys that's attacking them? Are, are they just waiting for this? My sweet Sid? My sweet Sid? You love the beat! <laughs> Will Oriana go berserk now and beat them all without magic? His, his body was really just left there? Alright, now we'll watch him get up. Alright, time to be Shadow now. <laughs> so how is he gonna heal himself? Let's see. If it's an actual injury, I don't even know. Huh? What do you mean? He's restarting his heart! He's actually restarting his heart! This is... The self BPR. <laughs> How is he? You gotta, you know, breathe your into your mouth too. <laughs> Tasuga, Shadow Sama, of course, of course. But is it actual blood? What about the injury? It was just fake. You... What, what was it? No, another secret technique, of course. Ten minute death heartbreak. Uh, you still use magic. No. It's okay, so he can still kind of use it, right? It's not complete. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Are they after the artifact? Sherry, I saw your window! Who's gonna save her? Shadow. Maybe. <laughs> Where are you? <laughs> Hello. Oh. 
fast sleight of hand. She's no garden. Yeah, I forgot the line. <laughs> I'm Rex. Shadow? The girls? Uh, who? Oh, one of the sun. Like, the, there's the two knights that um, Iris uh, provided with guard for her, right? Glenn, the lion's mate. Oh, he's a vice commander. Glenn and Marco. Salute. I hope they don't die. Did you just die? Wait, I was doing, you know, my death salute as like a, just, just to be cautious, but I think he just died. Okay, put on your shadow uniform, come on. Wait, but isn't the shadow uniform like kind of slime? I don't know. Hmm, Iris is also trapped outside. Everything is very cliche. This is the perfect moment, dude. Yes, your fantasy of getting invaded by a terrorist. This is the best possible scenario. Now what? The eminence and shadow. Yes. So edgy. But you gotta save... Right? You gotta save them now. No sense of aesthetics. Is he really judging their fucking outfit right now? <laughs> oh my god. I mean, they're trying their best to copy you, you know? Just to, you know, the color black, but... Really? Because of aesthetics? He's gonna... Ooh. Damn. Damn. Okay. I mean, the slime is very versatile. But he's really just gonna wait till nighttime just so that his outfit can pop out more. It's gonna... I can't use my shadow outfit unless it's nighttime, guys. <laughs> You're so cute, Cherry. <laughs> That's one for you. Don't worry about it. Mission <laughs> complete. Mission complete. Whenever he like, speaks in English, it's pretty funny, too. Yeah, but we still have to wait for nightfall. Then you'll save them all. I guess not this episode. Maybe the next episode will be really hyped on. Oh. Damn, this is a this is a super cool drop. Head first. Show us the landing at least. Oh, he's still looking after Sherry. No. It definitely wasn't, but sure, Sherry. Damn, she's wearing slippers too, of all things. I mean, yeah, she's, she wasn't prepared to run. Behind you, Sherry. Sherry. Ah, oh, just must be my imagination once more. Hee <laughs> hee, just my imagination. <laughs> these, these guys are all just getting dropped. <laughs> hey. Bye-bye. Just my imagination. Really? Even the sound? You heard that sound! Whatever. Is she really just crawling up the stairs to be, you know, very silent? <laughs> this angle, though. Is he gonna help catch her? But you can't. Oh. Okay. That's pretty cool. Once again, he saves her, but that this time was super cool. Love at first sight. Hmm. She's definitely in love with them. I mean, so is Oriana now. And kind of Alexia too. And all the girls, of course. What? Yeah, stop saying it's just my imagination out loud. Be careful, Sherry. Yeah, you're slip you're wearing slippers still, but again, she was in the lab research room trying to be comfortable. Too much for such as I'm atomic and freaking nuclear, they couldn't do it. I mean <laughs> Oh god, what's he gonna show us, dude? Hmm. Releases it all at once. One big blast, like a nuclear bomb? But, okay, this is an interesting mechanic going on, 
because Sid is going to show up. He will use something where the Eye of Avarice can't absorb everything and then will explode. But while doing that, we're also going to feel like, oh, shit, everyone else is going to die from this explosion and Sid will probably do something to also negate that and be even more cool is my, my guess. Oh, this thing can stop the explosion then. Okay. Oh, the knight's pretty upset about this. Yeah, Rex, you're fucking around a bit too much. Oh. Okay. Let's fuck around with them. There's a little bit of clash between the two, but... Thirds and seconds. Yeah, there is. You'll find them later tonight. This guy is gonna get folded by Sid. Absolutely. Oh, there's the eye. Your ambitions. Uh, again, uh, I'm not a member of the rounds though, again. Like before we had Zena who wants to join the rounds, and this time we have an ex rounds member. I wanna see an actual rounds member, but they're still, you know, we're getting there slowly. Oh, Shadow? Sid, from where? This is soundtrack. This is a perfect fitting, you know, soundtrack for Shadow. Hello! Palm strike to the face. Alright, Rex, it's time to get humiliated. No, it's just his base speed, probably. Oh, nuts. No, explain it then. <laughs> do you know what I just did? Let me explain to you my power. The most cliche thing to do. We're not using it, though. This copium, dude. <laughs> Behind you. <laughs> you can't be my net! Is he just gonna kill him with palm strikes in the face? Yeah, it doesn't really matter to him. <laughs> it's just him being him. No artifact involved. Dark, what's going on? This is where all his like friends were killed, I guess. What the hell are things? All the bodies, we gathered them here! This is kind of like, Imagine if you're wrecked right now. This would be actually terrifying. Oh. Spider-Man pose. Hello. And he's dead. I wanted to play with- I wanted him to kind of like just play with him a little bit more, but... <laughs> of course you guys did. Don't do it! No, no, don't ruin the fun for me! No, 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 no. I, I... <laughs> don't... But wait, wait, but he's under the assumption that... They're not an actual orc, and you know, this is all a joke, and he's just doing him, so yeah. Oh, hey, oh. the outfits become done because you know, you can't keep up these shat slime outfits. Yeah, Gamma's not. Yeah, Gamma's all. <laughs> Jesus, every time she falls, just. I... <laughs> in the ass. Yeah. Yeah. Not really, but the pinker girl does. He's just saying what Sherry told him, and now she's gonna be like, Sasuga, Shadow Sama, you're so smart. <laughs> yeah, don't worry about it. <laughs> and now New's gonna have newfound fucking respect for him. I just realized something. You know how in the previous episodes I be I kept saying I don't trust Cherry's dad. Why does he why does he keep pushing Cherry to learn about the artifact? Now we know that the knight, the main knight dude, was had that artifact, you know, the eye, and he's saying my ambitions will come true. What if the knight dude is Sherry's dad? Because where has Sherry's dad ever been so far? We haven't seen him. We only see that knight dude. Conspiracy theory, tinfoil theory, guess, but what if he is Sherry's dad? I think, I think that's a good guess, right? I, may, maybe it's a little bit of a reach and I'm still kind of reaching from, I don't know why I thought Sherry's dad was kind of like sus, just because he was so pushy for Sherry to use her knowledge to figure out that artifact because those two go in tandem, right? So maybe, maybe not, probably not. But if it is, like, I got it, I got it. So. Next episode is going to be the pop-up episode. A little bit more setup, but still a lot of fun time. Of course, Sid using his background secret arts to save himself. His magic is like his slime magic because it's like unrecorded. It's still a little bit available and some other mechanics about the eye, right? So 
if we were to use a magic that, of course, no human alive right now could possibly, you know, exceed the capacity to absorb the mana. But if someone were to say, I am atomic, then the entire thing blows up. But if we have the artifact and we combine it, then apparently it can prevent that. But I want to see, we got to go beyond I am atomic, right? There's got to be some even more hype shit. So next episode, get ready for it. But hey, if you stick around this song and if you enjoy my reaction, you already know what I'm going to say. Check out the other videos in place to my channel. If you watch another video immediately after this one, it helps the YouTube algo push out my small channel to recommend it so that I have a chance to compete with some of our favorite reactors. Until next time, guys, take care.